good to go we've got about 20 people but I'm sure some people maybe slept in just a little bit so just um, in case you missed us guys a quick introduction um, we are the co-founders and head coaches at Best Body Co um, my name is Olivia I'm Adam and today we have a full body strength and conditioning workout for you so the entire workout is going to go for around 45 to 60 minutes Let's see how we go. There'll be some rest periods in between as well. And we'll always demonstrate for you some beginner to intermediate, as well as some advanced versions of the exercise. So you can always stay on track as well. So hopefully you guys are ready to work hard. We've got lots of exercise, we've got lots of fun. So, so push as hard as you can today. If you need to rest or you need to regress any of the exercises, we're here yeah. to help as well. And this session is brought to you by a all a core live limitless. That's what we've got to do. All right, guys, let's start with our warm up first up, yeah? First up, guys, just we're gonna do some um, basic exercises to get our body ready for the main movements. The first one is a 30 second glute bridge. So come down to the floor. We're gonna hit that music up just so you can hear us as well. Let's get down on the floor, guys. So your glute bridge, hands by your side, heels in close to the butt, and you push your hips up, back down, touch the floor. So up, squeeze your butt at the top, and then come back down. So up, squeeze, back down. On this one, you wanna push through your heels, rest your head on the floor, and push those hips as high as you can. We're only going for 30 seconds, so you wanna squeeze as hard as you can on this one. If you wanna speed it up, if you're feeling good this Friday morning, start to thrust up a little higher, everyone. 10 seconds left. Almost there. Drop, push, drop, push. Starting to feel that energy of the music. Should be feeling like they're about to cramp those Three, hamstrings. two, one. All right, guys, come up to standing. Next up, we're gonna move into an inchworm with a push-up. This is what it looks like. Come down, touch the floor, walk out with your hands, push up. Walk yeah. back into standing. So that yeah. one, that one we have 30 seconds. So as many as you can in this one. So with this one, guys, you can also do the push up on your knees. Three, two, one. Let's go, guys. 30 seconds. Walk out. Inch one. Push All up. Together, guys. Remember, we are just getting started. So on the way up, try and keep those legs locked. Squeeze the butt at the top. I'll give you guys a time check along the way. That's it, as many as you can. Halfway through now, guys, 15 seconds to go. Brace your abs. Try to get your chest down to the floor. Give me a couple more. That's it, as many as you can, guys, get that chest to the floor. How are we doing, everybody? Five, four, three, two, and one. Morning, Salma, thanks for joining in. Give us a heart if you're feeling a little bit warm now, but I think you guys probably need a little bit more for your warm up. Next up, we're gonna move into some mobility work. First one is a reverse lunge with an upward reach. Yeah, so on this one, all you're gonna do is big step back, try and touch the roof, you're gonna squat legs. So step back, squeeze the butt at the bottom, big reach back as far as you can. On this one, we're going to do 10 each side. Hi guys, thanks for waving. Good job guys. So, bring that back knee all the way to the floor, okay? If I show you guys from the side, you want to get 90 degree angles with the front and back leg, okay? So if you want to regress that, make it a little bit easier. Just keep the hands on the hips and just stepping back. More advanced is the one that Olivia's doing. So, so just stepping back. Just work at your own pace. All right, hopefully you guys are getting close to done now. 10 reps on each leg. When you are done with that exercise, guys, I want you to follow along with me. Next up is a prisoner good morning. Hands behind your head, elbows out to the side, feet under the hips. Push your hips back, bring your back parallel to the floor. Your legs should be straight, but your knees should be soft. Give us 10 reps, showing you from the side. So you should feel a stretch through the back of the hamstrings on this one. Just try and keep that chest and your back as flat as you can. If you're struggling with that position with your hands, just keep your arms across your chest. Same thing. So it's a little bit easier. 
what I'm doing on this one, but you guys get the idea. So when you guys have finished your prisoner good mornings, you are going to move into a walking quad stretch. Thumbs up if you guys can hear us okay, just so we can make sure the sound settings are good. Yes, awesome. All right, let's take it away, Adam. Walking quad stretch. Okay, so walking quad stretch on this one, you're going to opposite arm, opposite leg, pull that leg back, and then you're going to swap. So each side pulling back on this one, we're going to get 10 each side on here. So pull that knee back as far as you can. If you're struggling with the hand on this one, just pull back, swap, pull back, swap, pull back, swap. But we prefer you guys, opposite hand back, opposite hand back, opposite hand back. That's it. Good job guys, just keep working at your own pace. So when, when you finish that one, once you've got 10 on each side, you're gonna do a leg cradle. So leg cradle on this, you're gonna lift that leg up, swap, swap, swap. If you wanna make it a little bit harder, you're gonna pull that leg a little bit higher and stand up on the tippy toes as much as you can on this one. Okay. You can do a little dance in between if you want to. Knees up wide, guys. Ooh. Give us 10 on each side. That's it. So keep, keep working, everyone. Keep working, keep breathing. Don't Hopefully you're all feeling warmer. Morning, Lauren. Hello, hello. We got a nice group here this morning. You guys are hard working morning movers. When you've done those leg cradles, guys, come down to the floor. We've got a what? This one. We've got a quadruped T spine twist. Take one hand behind your neck. Elbow goes down to the floor. Rotate your elbow up to the ceiling. So this is called your quadruped so T spine one, twist. As far as you can twist at the top, you want to try and rotate open. So you're going to open up the thoracic spine and open up that chest at the front. So you've got on this one, you've got ten each side. So ten on the right, ten on the left. So big rotation guys, control your breathing. Four, you want to exhale at the top. Ten on each side guys. Then once you get your ten, you swap sides. And always remember, look up at the top. How's everybody doing? Are you warm or are you warm? If you're not warm, that's okay. We're going to do one more round of our warm-up, guys. So, if you're still with Adam, keep working. Otherwise, come along with me. You've got your reverse lunge to upward reach. Ten on each side. Yeah, it's a big reach. Whoop. Try and keep that balance. But remember, if you're struggling with your balance, easier option, just keep your hands on your hips on this one. So, big steps back. Make it a little bit harder. Try and get the biceps to touch your ears. So biceps to ears on this one. See it. Big Good breath. job guys. You want to breathe out as you reach. Breathe out as you reach. That's it. Looking good guys. When you've done those lunges guys, move to your next exercise, your prisoner good mornings. Come along with me and Adam. Elbows wide, chest out, proud. Squeeze the butt at the top, yeah? You'll feel a little tug or a little pull over the back of the legs. If you can't get your arms behind your head because you're too tight through your upper body, just arms across the chest, coming down. It's like you're bowing. Just done a performance, you come down, you bow. So keep that leg, the back straight. Just trying to get those hamstrings Hamstrings, lower back, maybe even a little bit of your calves. Next up guys, move straight into your walking quad stretch. Opposite arm and opposite knee extends up, yeah? That's it, it's a big reach. And remember on all of these exercises, you want to exhale in, these, in the hardest part of the stretch. So for example, in this one, breathe out, breathe out, breathe out, that's it. So really important when you're stretching, not to hold your breath. You want to exhale. Good job guys, 10 reps each side of that walking quad stretch. When you're done, shift the direction. Move into your leg cradle. That's it. It's good guys, looking good. That's it guys, good job. 
Remember, big chest. Lift your chest up, pull your shoulders back. Great job, everyone. Keep working. And then after your leg cradle, guys, 10 on each side, back down to the floor. Last one, quadruped T-spine twist. 10 on each. That's it. So remember on this one, as you twist, get to the top, exhale at the top, exhale at the top. That's it. And use your eyes to stretch. So look at the top. Don't look at the floor. Look up as you're twisting. The more you look around, the further you're going to twist. That's it. Once you get your 10, you're going to swap sides. You go to the other side. So you get your 10. All right, guys. Keep moving. How's everyone doing? Are you guys feeling ready? Give us some likes, give us some love if you are feeling ready. All right, that's a lot of love. I think everyone's ready. <laughs> so we're now gonna take some time to explain the main part of the workout, okay? We have two wads or two workouts to get through. Basically your first workout, we're gonna be working for 15 minutes continuously, okay? So it'll be a full body strength and conditioning circuit, body weight only. You don't need anything except for yourself and some hard work, okay? So basically we have five different exercises. We are going to work 40 seconds on and then 20 seconds of rest. So we'll all be working together. Adam and I will demonstrate beginner and advanced movements. Now the first, in the first 40 seconds, you will basically be doing five squats, five air squats and then five squat jumps. So feet a little wider than the hips, hips come down to the knees, give me five of these and then increase the intensity. Five jumping squats, okay? So you keep going, five air squats, five jumping squats for 40 seconds. The full time, so we're all gonna be doing it together. If you're a beginner, what you will do, just do low impact air squats the entire time. Don't worry about jumping, okay? Yeah, and it's just continuous, guys. If you need to take a little bit of rest, if you're fasting and you're struggling, just take a little bit of rest, but pre preferably try and work for the full 40 seconds then we'll give you guys 20 seconds rest. Your next exercise is a push-up climber. So what you will do is one push-up, two climbers each side. Let me show you guys. So you can do your push-up on your knees or your toes. One push-up, one, two, three, four. One push-up, one, two, three, four. Okay? Now, if you are a beginner, what you will do instead is just your mountain climbers. So don't worry about the push-up, just take the knees as close to your elbows as you can, okay? That's your beginner option. The next exercise, exercise three, is your same side lunge matrix, okay? So for example, if you start on the right leg first, lunge forward, step back, move out of the way, Adam. Lunge to the side, lunge to the back, then come back, front, side, back, okay? So you're gonna do that for the full 40 seconds, and the next exercise, you'll do the exact same thing, but on the other leg, okay? So, both beginners and advanced, you can do that exercise, okay? And then the final exercise is your plank toe touches. So I'll show you guys from the side. You start in a plank, in a high plank position, shoulders over your wrists, reach out, touch your toes. Opposite hand to your opposite foot. Yeah. So all you need to do on these guys is basically, once we start together, you're gonna copy what we're doing. So we're doing it all at the same time as you guys. So guys, just one more quick thing. If you are a beginner and that's a little bit too difficult, what you will do is just hold a plank as a beginner for that fifth exercise, okay? Thumbs up if that all makes sense. Give us a thumbs up. Yes, yes, yes. Cool, cool. Hello, Robson. Thanks for joining. Hi, Alba. All right, guys. So I'm gonna start the clock. Adam's gonna turn up that music to give us some energy. Although I think we've got enough energy between us all. Yep. Okay guys, so remember, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. We have three rounds and it's gonna take us 15 we're minutes. We're just doing what we're doing guys, so copy what we're doing at the front. Get ready to go guys, in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go guys, five squats, five squat jumps. Beginners, just take regular squats, okay, the whole time. I will give you guys time checks along the way. Five and five. Good job, guys. Use your arms to get some height. 
Bring you back to the start. Five. Keep going. Halfway. 20 seconds down. Full range means four results, okay? Especially five in the five. first round. Good job, guys. Come on. Recovery's coming. Five squats, five Three, squats. Three, two, one. Rest. Everybody stop. Catch your breath, shake it out. Next exercise. We've got push up climbers next. One push up, two mountain climbers. Get ready to go. Catch you guys come down. Three, two, one. Let's go. One push up. Two mountain climbers each side, four in total. Remember, for our beginners, all you will do, regular mountain climbers only, okay? Otherwise, add that push up. Halfway through, 20 seconds down. Keep going guys, right to the end. If you need to do push ups, you can do them on your knees, another option, otherwise on the tippy toes. Three, two, one, rest. Good job guys, two exercises done. 20 seconds rest. Next one, same side, lunge matrix. Let's do the right leg first. We've got five seconds and we're off together. Three, two, one, forward, side, back and repeat. If you want to go a little faster, go a little faster. If you need to go slower, that's okay as well. Whatever you do, take a big long stance. Try to get your back knee as close to the floor as you can. Good job guys. Not long to go. Staying on that right leg. All on the right side. Whee. Whew. How's that sweat coming along? <coughs> it's pretty hot already, right? Three, two, one, stop. Now we got the left side, move back to the left. I'll let you take frontal position, Adam. Frontal. 10 seconds, guys, enjoy that rest. The so left is going forward first. Three, two, one, let's left go. Forward. Left, right. And step back. So forward, side, back. Full range, guys. Come on, get low. Try and get that back knee down. Halfway. As much as you can. If you want to take it up a notch, move a little faster, yeah? Get a little lower. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Good job, guys. Almost there. Good job, guys. Next one, plank toe touches, all right? You've got 10 seconds left to recover. If you're a beginner, just hold your regular plank. Five. Yeah, two options, guys. Three, two, one. Opposite hand, opposite foot. Squeeze your abs. Squeeze your glutes. Try to keep your legs straight. Remember if you can't do this one, just come down, hold that plank. So you're going to try and hold that plank for 40 seconds total, yeah? Otherwise, take that more advanced option, touch the toes. Make sure you shift your body weight forward, okay? You want your shoulders to come all the way over your wrists. Hips come up into a pike, then come down parallel to the floor. Three, two, one. Woo! Awesome. Easy or hard? We are one round done, guys. We're gonna do that set all over we're again. Two, one more time. Two more times. Two more times. 15 minutes, guys. So, one round done, second round starts. Squats, five squats, five jump squats. Three, two, one. Go again. Remember, feet a little wider than the hips. And once you get your five, you get those jumps. Good job, guys. 
Now, if you remember the number of reps you did in your first round, I want you to try to match it or exceed it, yeah? Keep working, halfway. 20 seconds down. That's it, five and five. Great work, everybody. 10 seconds. Heart rate should be up on these ones. Woo. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job, guys. Keep going, keep going. Take a breather. Take a drink if you need to, if you're not fasting. Five seconds. Push up climber. Three, two, one. So push up. One, two, three, four. Push up. One, two, three, four. If you can't, if you're doing the more basic or beginner option, all you're going to do on this one is your mountain climber. So from here, knees, 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 knees. The whole time without doing the push up. More advanced option with the push up. Halfway, guys, 20 seconds down. Just be careful if your house is anything as sweaty as ours. You want to make sure you don't slip, so wipe down that sweat. 10 seconds, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Good job, guys. Doing well. Keep going. Stay with it. We've got a little rest. You guys know what's next, yeah? A little bit more leg work. We have your lunge matrix next. Right leg. Three, two, one. Let's go. Forward lunge, side lunge, reverse lunge. Woo! You guys are liking the pain then, yes? Doesn't it feel good to work out in the morning? This is gonna help set you up with healthy habits and behaviors for the rest of the day. Halfway. Try to get down low. Now remember, in that lateral lunge, both feet parallel, one leg bent as far down as you can. So you're trying to get into a bit of a rhythm on this one, guys. It's all about rhythm. Time. Whew. Well done. Legs are feeling it. So now you're gonna go to the left leg. Hopefully what, left. What you do on one, you gotta do to the other, yeah? Five seconds and we're off together. Three, two, one. Let's go, everybody. Front, side, back. I want to know if you're feeling good this morning. Woo! It's good for a Friday. Good job, guys. We're loving your energy. That's it. But don't spend too long talking to us. We want you guys to be working hard at home. 10 seconds left. Almost there, guys. Five, four, three, two, one, done. Good rest, guys. How's everyone feeling? One more exercise to complete your second round. Plank toe touches, yeah? We'll show you from the side. Five seconds. Three, two, one, let's go. Reach back. Don't let your hips drop. If you're feeling good, move a little faster. Beginners, remember, this is your option. It's pretty tough to hold the plank for 40 seconds. So you can always do this as well. Squeeze hard. 15 seconds to go. How are we doing guys? Rest is coming, don't stop. Keep going guys, till the end. Three, two, one. Stop. Good job guys, two rounds done. One more to go. Stay with it. Stay strong. Everybody all right? You guys are doing well, stay with us. First exercise, five squats, five squat jumps. Are you good? Let's do it guys, time is on, five and five. But don't just stop at five, do as many rounds as you can for the time. Use your arms to get height. 
the higher you jump, the lower you land, the more calories you're going to burn. All right, push hard team, halfway. Knees drive wide. Remember guys, five normal squats, five jump squats. Good job everyone, come on, work hard, recovery's coming. Last time you do this exercise, five, four, three, two, one. Woo. Virtual fist pump, boom. Shake out those legs guys. Next up, push up climbers. Five, three, come on down, let's go. One push up, two mountain climbers. One, two, three, four, drop. Option to do it on your knees if you're struggling on these push ups. You can always drop to your knees, push up on the knees, mountain climber on the toes. If you can't do the push up for whatever reason, you can just do the mountain climber. So just continue us on the mountain Come on, guys, 10 seconds. Last few push ups. Go. Push it up, push it up. Let's go team, come on Adam. Three, two, one, rest. Well done guys. Recovery for 20. Lunges up next. So remember we start with the right first. That's it, definitely getting harder. Three, two, one. You're just building up the fatigue guys, but don't worry. At the end of this round, we're gonna give you two minutes of rest when we explain the next part of the workout, and you're gonna love it, hopefully. Good job, guys. I see some sweaty faces, or some sweaty emojis on that screen. Get all the way down, guys. Try and get the back leg to touch the floor, or as close as you can to touching the floor. If you wanna make it a little bit easier, just don't go as deep on this one. Come on guys, work till the end. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. And you got the lefty, the left leg's gonna work on the next one. 10 seconds. Get ready to go guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's do it. Front, side, step it back. Awesome job, guys. Stay with us. We are so close now. Last two exercises for what number one. Keep going, everyone. So big chest, stay tall. So I want you guys to keep your head up on this one. So you should be able to look at the screen the whole time. Don't look at your shoes or your feet. 10 seconds left. Five. Four, three, two, one. Woo. Almost there, guys. Last one. Well done, guys. Give yourself a pat on the back. Last one. Plank toe touches. Off in 10 seconds. First one. I'll go front. Three, two, one. Finish it strong, guys. Let's go, guys. That's it. We've got a few sweaty faces. That's it. Keep going, guys. Doing well. That's it. Work with Olivia. I'm joining you too. We're all in it together, guys. All together at home. Living without limits. No excuses, just getting it done. Halfway. You can do a little dance in recovery, yeah? 10 seconds. Keep working guys, come on, home stretch. For five, four, three, two. Everyone likes my dancing and that's done. Awesome job guys. Give yourselves a little pat on the back. You guys nailed that first wad, yeah? So, let's turn down that music just a touch. Guys, grab a drink of water now if you need it. Now's your opportunity. If you're fasting, obviously no, no water, but just wipe your sweat. So make sure, because we don't want you guys slipping on the floor. Okay, all good, that's it. All right guys, so 
Basically, this is very short blocks of work now. Your second wad is basically four mini wads in one. What we have is a Tabata training set, okay? So Tabata is just four minutes of work for one round. You've got 20 seconds of work, followed by 10 seconds of rest, and you're gonna repeat a superset of two different exercises. We're gonna give you a one minute rest at the end of each Tabata round. Let us demonstrate for you the exercises first, okay? For my advanced athletes out there watching at home or working out with us at home, hopefully, you've got gorilla burpees for 20 seconds. This is what it looks like. Jump into a lunge, jump into a lunge, jump into a squat, jump out, jump in, okay? So it's two lunges, a squat, and a sprawl. You don't take the chest to the floor. One more time, lunge, lunge, squat, sprawl. For my beginners, guys, what you will do instead to replace that is a burpee. So jump out, chest to the floor, jump in, jump up, okay? Do a regular burpee. If that gets too much, remove the jump at the top of the burpee, okay? That's your first exercise, but we'll be working with you. Next exercise is single leg hollow rocks. You're gonna do 20 seconds on one leg. So you will bring one knee up to the chest, lay down, arms out in front of you, swing your body forward and back, keep your shoulders and chest off the floor. You will do one leg for the entire 20 seconds, and then when we move to rounds three and four, you will change legs. So you'll end up doing two rounds on each side, okay? Give us some love, some thumbs up, if that all makes sense. Yes, it does. Good. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's turn that music on, Mr. DJ. All right, here we go. So four minutes of work, guys. We're good? Listen to the music and we'll count you in, guys. Round one, Tabata. Four minutes, this is it. Are you ready, guys? Yeah, we are. Gorilla burpees, lunge. Squat, sprawl. September. You can sing along if you want to distract yourself. Three, two, one, stop, rest. Lay down on the floor, single leg, hollow rocks. Knees up to the chest. Let's go. Swing forward, swing back. For my beginners, if it's too much, just do a leg raise hold. Otherwise, keep rocking. Try and keep your legs straight. The straighter your legs, the better. And try and roll. Three, two, one. Stop. Stand. Good job, guys. There you've got a taste. So now you should be good with the rest of the Tabata. So back to the grill of burpees. Two lunges, one squat jump, one scroll. If you want to make it even harder, take your chest down with Adam. Rest. Good job, guys. Well done. You're doing Lay well. Lay down. Other leg now. Go. Single leg, hollow rocks. And remember, if you want to take it more basic, you can just do a leg hold. So hold that position there. That's it. Alternatively, with me and Olivia. Oh, abs are burning, right? Roll on up. Halfway, guys. Gorilla burpees again. Let's do it. Don't have to take the chest to the floor. Keep it off the ground if you need. One, rest. Back down. Single leg, hollow rocks. How are we doing? You guys got this. The lower your legs, the harder it is. So you're trying to roll your spine on the floor. Four, three, two, one, rest. How's everybody doing? Oh, I know it's tough, guys, but you've got it. 
Gorilla burpees, go! Option to do your regular burpees. Otherwise, challenge your body with us. Thank goodness that one's over, right? Not Doing quite. Doing good, guys. Well done. One final round. Let's go. Heart rates are high. We'll tell you. Knees up, guys. Your heart rate should be at about 75 to 85% of your max. So in your yellow to red zone. Three, two, one. Stop. Take a pause, Adam. Well done, guys. My heart rate is at 150 plus. What's yours at? We want to know. Give us your heart rate if you're wearing some sort of fitness tracker. But we don't want you guys to take too much rest. We are going to move on to the next exercise or the next Tabata round. So same, same exact format as we just did. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We're going to alternate between two exercises. So guys, the next exercise for my advanced athletes, you guys have got six high knees to a sprawl. One, two, three, four, five, six. Do not touch the floor. Jump out, jump in. We want it fast. Three, four, five, six. Jump out, jump in. As many as you can. For the beginners, what you will do, just march on the spot six times and then come down, step out into your sprawl and step in, okay? So you step it out. One, two, three, four, five, six. Step it out. Step it in. Remember on all of these, posture is important. So stay up nice and tall. We don't want to be slouching. You want to be tall when you do this. The next exercise you will do in that superset, you alternate between the two, you've got bear jacks. This is what it looks like. So basically you'll be in a bear position, shoulders over your wrists, hips over the knees. From here, take your knees about an inch away from the floor, jump out, jump in, jump out, jump in, jump out, jump in. So imagine, if Adam put a cup of coffee on my back, hopefully not a hot one, then I wouldn't get burned. You try to keep your body as still as you can with a small jump on the legs, okay? Now, if that bear jack is too much, for my beginners, you will simply hold the bear position for 20 seconds. Yep. Squeeze your core, just hold it, and keep your knees off the ground, so okay? same thing on that one, pretend there's a hot, hot cup of coffee on your back, you don't want to spill it. And it's actually harder than it looks. Even just the, the static position is just as hard as, as the bear jacks on there. Especially next. toward the second half. Yep. Yes or yes, guys. Yes or yes. Thumbs up. Let's do it, guys. Yep. All right, let's do it. Listen to the music. Change the track. Yes. Yeah. We're survivors. I love a bit of Destiny's Child. Here we go. Six high knees to sprawl. Let's go. As many as you can, guys. Come on. Heart rate high. Push your limits just 20 seconds. And just swing those arms as you do this one. Done. See? It goes quick, so you don't want to miss a beat. Bear jacks next. Come on down. Or your bear hover. Survivor. We're not gonna give up. Don't give up guys, it's only round two. In, out, in, out. Can you feel it? Good job, that was guys. a taste. Boom. You got six rounds to go. Six high knees to sprawl. Yalla! One, two, three, four, five, six, sprawl. Good job, guys. How many can you get? Try and keep up with us if you can. Nice. Nice and nice. Whew. Good, good and good. Hey, Jane. Hey, Persa. 166. Nice. Bear jacks. Bear position, guys. I want to hear you growl. I want to hear your legs scream! Three, two, one. Half time. Let's do it again. 
Keep going, guys. Doing well. Ready? Ready or not? Ready or not? Go. You're better than that. You're better than that. Yeah, we are. This is now Live Limitless Karaoke and Workout. Rest. It's good, guys. If you're getting a little fatigued or too exhausted, take your options, scale it back. Bear jacks or bear hover? So remember guys, bear hover is what Olivia is doing here, and what I'm doing is bear jack. If you want to challenge your body, give it a little try, add a few reps. Another two. Yes? Two to go. I think you can. High knees for six. One scroll. High fives, guys. Two Tabatas done. How are we feeling? Give us an emoji, tell us how you're feeling. Woo. Should be well a sweaty, done. sweaty emoji on this one. Right, guys, we're not done. We're halfway through our Tabata one. Next Tabata, new two set of exercises. We're gonna demo. So basically the first exercise is two sumo squats and one squat jump. So take your feet out nice and wide. Toes turned out. Two sumo squats, one jump. Two sumo squats, one jump, okay? Continuous. For the beginners out there, what you will do, just keep going in the sumo squats. Don't worry about the jump, yeah? All right, next exercise, bit of upper body strength. You've got tricep push-ups, all right? So you can do your tricep push-ups on your knees or on your toes. Tricep push-ups, you want to keep the elbows in. Don't flare the elbows out, you want to keep them locked in. If you need to, do it on your knees on here, so chest to the floor, back up. For the advanced athletes out there on the toes, same thing. But remember, those elbows should be grazing the side of your ribs. Don't let the elbows come out, okay? No chest push-ups. Not for this one. So we're good, yes and yes. <laughs> yes or yes, guys, yes or yes. Yes, they're ready, they are ready to smash it. We're just giving you guys too much rest. Let's go again, guys. Here we go, so Next let's four listen minutes. to the trip music. Whoops, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Sumo time. Two, two sumos, one squat jump. You can go faster than us. Or you can go slower. Up to you. Get deep, guys. Rest. That's one round done. Tricep push ups. Knees or toes. You choose. Three, two, one. Hands in close. Elbows squeeze past your rib cage. Two, we've got six to go. Six rounds to go. Three, two, two squats, one jump. Two. One jump. I'm gonna get a little closer so I can see what's going on at home. Out wide, guys. Three, two, one, stop. 
back to those tricep push-ups. If you need to do them on your knees, do them on your knees. Second round gets harder. Let's go. Every round, you'll be feeling a little more fatigue. All we want you to do is stay strong and keep moving. Work at your very own pace. Halfway, guys. Good job, guys. Doing well. From your upper, but shift to the lower. Two, one, go. Sumos. I see you, Solon. Come on, let's work. Let's work, team. Dance for me. Do the squats. Squats are our version of dancing. Rest. Good job, guys. Yeah. Tricep push ups. Hit the deck, guys. One, two, one, two. Fire out those reps. Full range, chest low. Woo. How about it? Have you got two more left in the tank? Two more, guys. Three, two, one, go! Sumo, one jump. Knees out wide, guys. I know it's hard. I know your legs are feeling heavy. Almost there. Whew. Rest, rest, rest. Tricep push for us one more time. Last round. Try and get at least 10 reps. Minimum 10. Don't stop. Don't quit. Another one down. Well done, guys. You've earned yourself another rest. Good job, guys. Doing really well. Take Ooh. a breather. Next up, we only have one left, okay? This is probably my favorite round, one of my favorite exercises. Not because it's the last one, because we would love to stay with you guys all day. Next round of Tabata, guys, you know the drill 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. The first exercise is your body weight man maker. You don't need any equipment, your body weight's enough, okay? So, this is what it looks like, guys. First of all, you will jump. Jump down onto the floor into a sprawl. From here, take one push up, one shoulder tap each side, jump in, jump up, come down. Push up, one shoulder tap each side, jump in, jump up. So, it's basically three in one. Three exercises in one, that's your body weight man maker. Beginners, I want you to do a sprawl instead. Let me show you that sprawl. Jump down, jump out, jump in, jump up. Jump down, out, in, up. Okay? So option on that one. Next exercise, guys, bit of core work. You've got your rolling side plank. So you'll start in a low plank position on your forearms. On your toes, if you can, rotate to one side. Arm comes up, or keep your elbow bent like Adam. Rotate side to side, keeping the hips elevated. Four the whole 20 seconds, okay? Those are your two movements. Let's finish it strong, okay? Everybody good? Give us some love, it's the last one. Last one, Give guys. Give us some love, guys. Give us some love. We'll have a stretch and a cool down after this, so I want you guys to push right to the very oh, end. Uh, yeah, just give me one sec. We're going to find an epic track for you guys for the last one. Smooth, smooth criminal. criminal. Yeah. Let's get a bit of smooth criminal, guys. It'll be criminal <laughs> not to work out on a Friday morning. Are you ready? Are you ready guys? Body weight man makers, go! Push up, tap, tap. Jump, scroll, push up, tap, tap. Come on guys, you got this. Rest. Stop guys. Rotating side plank. 
fist pump we hope you enjoyed that session guys we're not quite done yet if you've got time to stick around Adam and I are going to take you through a cool down it's important to let your heart rate settle reflect on what an awesome job you guys have just done let's stretch it out guys all right so first one I want you guys to cross your left leg over your right and then all you're gonna do on this one is just hang down try and keep your legs locked and nice deep breaths on this one, okay? Try and bend your back. If you can touch your toes, touch your toes. If you can't touch your toes, grab your shins or your socks or your shoes. We're gonna hold for another three, two, one. You're gonna come back up, you're gonna swap sides. So cross that other leg over the top. That's it. Same thing, I'll get you guys hang down. That's it, try and touch the floor. Probably find one of the sides a little bit looser than the other, or tighter than the other, which is normal. That's it, just keep holding. Three, two, one. And then I'll get you guys just sitting on the floor for the next one. So all you're gonna do on the next one is just soles of your feet together on the next one. 
Okay, so pull your feet in like a butterfly stretch. And then you want to push your elbows into your calves or your shins. And then nice deep breath and then try and pull your head down as close as you can to your shoes. If you're super flexible, you should be able to actually get your head to touch. Olivia's almost there. Dip. Keep holding. We'll hold for another three, two, and one. Now, while we're on the mat, on the floor, I'm gonna get you, I'm just gonna go on the side. So on this one, all you're gonna do is just lying down like you're posing for Instagram. You're gonna pull that top leg up, trying to stretch that quad. So it'll give you a little bit of space. Or you can do the one like Olivia's doing there. So just pull back. Like that, I've said, give us a pose. Yeah, it's all about posing. We're on Instagram, <laughs> so we've got to live up to the Instagram. That's we're it. Doing it for the gram. And then we'll get you guys swapped, so change sides, go to the other side. So pull back, try and feel it at the front of that quad. Now for your glutes. So I'll show you on the side on this one. I want you to pull your top leg over, so your left leg, and then you're going to hug the opposite one in. So you're going to feel the outside of your glutes on this one. Or you could do what Olivia's doing now, where she's standing. So up to you guys if you want to do it on the floor, or you want to stand up, make it a little bit harder. So next one, you're going to swap. So swap sides, cross the other leg over. So pull it in. That's it. And then I'll get you guys sitting up for the next one. So all you're going to do here, or you can do it like Olivia's standing behind me. So you're going to get your right arm out. Pull it across your body, and then, and then look over. If, if I have the bunny ears behind me, I know what's going on. That's it. So always look away from the arm that you're stretching. And now get your release. You're gonna go to the other side, so pull it across. Keep that thumb down. Look over that shoulder. That's it. For three, two, one. Next one, we're going to loosen up those triceps. We did all those tricep push-ups and those push-ups. So next one, you're going to pull down behind your head. Try and lift that chest up as much as you can. So just holding for another five, four, three, two, one. And then we'll get you guys swapped. So change sides, go to the other side. That's it. So just pull down, try and lift that chest. If you want to make it even more spicy, twist into that side. So you'll get even through the laps on this one. All right, so lucky last. All you're gonna do just to finish off, just to reflect on the workout and how awesome you guys are, is we're gonna get you down, so knees out on here, just a child's pose. So knees out, you're gonna go head to the floor, and I wanna see your butts. Get, get your butt as low as you can down and try and get your chest and your head to touch the floor with your arms straight. That's it, awesome guys. So guys, we had a couple of technical errors, but hopefully you just took some time to finish off those stretches. We just wanted to say a big thank you for all of your energy for joining us this morning for today's Best Body Co. All a core live limitless workout. If you enjoyed that, guys, we do have a copy of the actual workout program that you can save, download, and print off. You just need to visit bestbodyco.com forward slash all M A A. That's A L L M A A. And you can download a copy of that workout program. We'll also email you guys a copy of the video if you do register to download that free workout. And of course, this video will stay live for the next 24 hours and um, also on the All MEA page on Instagram as well, guys. So be sure to check in with All MEA for other exciting activities and stuff that you can do at home. And hopefully we will see you guys soon. We run these kinds of workouts every day. So if you're interested in joining us, just follow us on Instagram and we hope to sweat with you again soon. See you guys. Big hugs, big virtual hugs, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. See you guys. See you guys soon.